Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you how to write a product review using AI. Vince from Digital Man Institute, and let's get started. So the very first thing you want to do, if you want to write a review just like this, and this is good for anyone trying to sell a physical product, such as anything on Amazon, or if you're trying to sell stuff on eBay and get some affiliate commission, then this is the great way to do it because you don't have to spend $15, $20 just for a product review and it can get very boring, All right? And this is just an example of a product review of this product right here. So this is a Casio ProTech RPG 270. And this is the product review that I created for that product. All right, so the very first thing you wanna do, you wanna to go to, Eventually, the AI I'm using is Closure's Copy because out of all the AIs I've tested, this is the best deal, the best value for your, your buck, right? So I use Closure's Copy. You can use it whatever AI you like, but in this case, I'm using Closure's Copy. Then from here, I click on New Project. I type in the name. I'm going to type in, I don't know, Amazon Products. Click on Save. Open this. Click on new document. I'm going to go watches, save again. Then I'm going to open the document up. Now from here, what you do is you go to frameworks and this is one I already have, but let me show you what it looks like when you don't, when you don't access it right away. So what you have to do is you have a drop down menu now and you have to scroll all the way down and pick what you like. I would, I'd screw down the products in this case. And then from here, you can go to name, description, product benefits, bullet points. I typically go with just a uh, description right here. And then from here, what you need to do is you need to copy elements of a uh, already pre-written uh, review. Like you, you need information about the product, like how, you know, how waterproof it is, the measurements, stuff like that. So in this case, I would just copy this to input the data only. All right. And then what it's going to do, go back here. What it's going to do is it's going to take your information and then it's going to create its own product description. And from down here, I typically like to set it to maybe, maybe 50% for creativity. And I click on right from, all right. They'll have a countdown timer up here to let you know how long it will take. This is a web-based web -based browser. You don't have to install anything. That's a good thing. The other great thing about Closure's Copy and why I like to use it a lot is there's a lot of AIs on the market that simply rip you off. They will charge you a monthly fee and then they'll charge you credits on top of those monthly fees. But if you stick all the way through, I'll show you a special way in which you can get this AI and, and just pay once. You don't have to pay any monthly fee. You don't have to deal with any credits. All right. so. You, you wait now that it's done and you go ahead and now you have your rewritten product description. And if it's a bit wonky, you might have to add a little bit more information. I might add, let's see, maybe this one right here, just to make it more interesting. All right. So that's a good thing. You don't have any, since you don't have any credits, you can just keep writing and adding more uh, content and more options for you without having to worry about running out of credits. You can also explore different things with other AI writers. What you have to do is you have to worry about credits and then you have to pay a monthly fee, such as let's see if you go to Jasper AI, they charge you like a ridiculous amount every single month. And then you have to, you get a limitation credit limitation. Uh, I really don't, I don't like that. It's either the way I figure if you're going to use AI, it has to be decent, but if you're going to charge a monthly fee, make it unlimited. And if you're not going to charge a monthly fee, make it a one time, one time deal. So here's a good one right here. This is the one I like. I'm going to copy it. All right, I'm going to add it in here. And what you can do now is you can modify it. You can change it. The other things you can do is you can take, you can highlight sections of this. Let's say up to here, right click. You can click on expand and it's going to fill it out. It's going to add, you know, more and more text, but I'm going to delete this. I like this. And the question I think most people are asking is how, let me improve this. What I like to do is I like to improve it and make it more readable. And then the improved function on this is unique to, uh, closes copy in that most improved 
most AI, they only allow you to select a few sentences and then you, you improve that. And you select a few more sentences and improve that with the closest copy. You can select the whole paragraph and, you know, get it improved. All right. So it's done. I'm going to copy, I'm going to, uh, copy this and I'm going to show you real quick how well it compares, how, how the readability is. And I'm going to have it, another AI called Grammarly AI. Oops. Let me go here. New document. I'm going to have it, you know, grade it, grade, essentially grade closes copies, read description for you. All right. So you have an objective idea of how well it did. All right. Let me go to inform, click on done. So you just give it a sec and it scored really well. 88 overall score, a lot better than Jasper typically scores around 80 and next clarity and uh, engagement. And delivery is just right. And let me see about plagiarism. And for those of you wondering what software with this, this is Grammarly premium. So I have to pay to use this. All right. So this is, this needs to be rewritten. No problem. All I have to do is go back and let's click on rewrite. And I want to see how much can it rewrite a article. So this is the rewritten article. Let's see which one I like. Seven. I want to go with maybe this one right here. Copy this one. Add this one in here. And then I'm going to go ahead and check. Let's see how unique this is. Much better. So as you can see, it scored a 31%. It's scored above 80, which is better than Jasper or Casper or whatever, or Content AI, whatever they want to call themselves now. And engagement is good. Delivery is just right. So as you can see, it, it's very easy to go ahead and create a product description using closest copy AI. And this, you can do many things with it. You can post this onto your blog post with affiliate links to your Amazon. But I recommend something better is you use this with another AI software tool to create a video and, and post it on YouTube and then put a link in the description. If you want to check out how to do that, I'll have a link in the description for you to, to go ahead and, and click on that. And you can go ahead and learn how you can turn this text and, and create a video from it. I hope this video was helpful. And if it was, could you please hit the like button? I'm Vince from Digital Man Institute and thank you so much for watching.